What's up everyone, it's Ali Reza Musavi, Redken artist from Sweden speaking and today I'm gonna share a really nice technique to create lowlights and highlights at the same time. Section the hair from back to front, side to side and then separate the side from top area. As you guys can see, we have a vertical line in the back all the way to the nape area. Product of choice is Shady Q Glass and we work with 09P for our highlight, 06NA combined with 06N for our low light and root shadow. We combine it with processing solution for precision application 1 plus 1. Start with the nape area by drawing a diagonal backward line. Our sections are about 2 inches thick and then you're gonna separate it in two subsections. You start with the lower section. Today we're gonna use an application bottle and then we're gonna start with our root shadow which was 06NA and 06N equal part plus processing solution. For the zone 2 and zone 3, we're gonna use our 09P to create that highlight effect in the hair. Whip your hand off and switch the color again from 09P to 06NA and 06N and then apply all over from zone 1 to 2 and 3. No need for any separation by foils or cotton. So we're gonna repeat the same thing by taking the lower section and applying the root shadow formula in zone 1 and then apply the 09P for the zone 2 and zone 3 and the section over gonna be the darker which is our low light which was 06NA and 06N. Reason being we are working with diagonal backward lines is to create softness and combine their high and low lights in a really great way. Notice we separate the side from top area just to create more dimension of colors. The first section is our lightest formula and the second is our darkest formula. The base color remain same. In that way we're gonna create a really soft root shadow and gonna create the low light and high light at the same time. Giving a gentle twist on each section gonna create the separation that we are looking for. For the face framing area, we're gonna use the darkest formula for root shadow and then we're gonna switch to the lightest formula for creating that face framing effect. We're working with diagonal backward lines and we switch between the light and dark formula on each section. The base color remains same. Repeat the same on the other side and let the hair process for 20 minutes. I hope you enjoyed this technique and if you like it, please give a thumbs up to this video and share it with your hairdresser friends. And for more educational video, visit Ali Reza's art on Instagram. Thank you for watching.